today I got a couple of projects I'm doing and one of them is uh, from last week's it's a two and a half inch Toshiba drive had two heads it's a 500 gig right from the get-go I was able to work with one of the heads but not the other and uh, from both of the donors that I've had my um, friend tried them on Friday and he wasn't able to get the device going I want to try it again to see and confirm that there was no issues other than just incompatibility um, and if the donor that is currently functional is not gonna work inside of the patient's drive um, I'll have to order up uh, a donor from the internet because I don't have any more so this is our failed unit this is our working unit let's run a quick test I think I got a box from one of the followers today. I wanted to do an unboxing on this. Oh my god. <laughs> this is awesome. This is amazing. Thank you so much. Um, this is uh, from Cognetic Team. Brian, thank you so much for uh, sending this in. I, I honestly, I'm, I'm blown away. I never got anything like this from one of my followers. Thank you so much for this lovely note. I'll quickly read what it says. Sorry to hear about your wrist since we can't get your donor wrist. <laughs> we thought we would send you a bunch of free donor drives. Hopefully they can be of some use to you. Thanks for the amazing videos. We have learned so much. This is this is beyond. Like this has actually made my week right now. Not even a day, like a whole week. So, and <laughs> this is so cool. This picture here with me and uh, the splint that they gave me at the at the hospital. I'm sure that a lot of people will benefit from this box because if I don't have something and this box does, those parts will be used. Thanks again. I do have another package that just arrived that I opened up already and it's a donor drive for the uh, device I've been trying to repair for a couple of days now and the closest one I could find was in Montreal which is uh, right here in my hand right now so this drive is going to be used today for the head assembly and hopefully it, we're going to have better luck with this one than with the one that I used out of my own stock.
So the drive is making same sounds that it was with uh, the head assembly that was used out of this drive, the first donor, and that's what it sounds like. So unfortunately the second donor did not match up as well and the drive is making same clicking sounds as it did with the first donor that I used from my stock. So I am actually going to have to bite the bullet and go ahead and purchase that drive from donor drives uh, for 179 bucks. <laughs> um, now there might be a pleasant surprise in the box that I received today from Brian and I'll go through that over the weekend to see maybe uh, there's a chance that this drive uh, or something compatible with this drive will be in that box. Thank you, Brian, once again for sending that box in. It really means a lot and um, really, <laughs> really brightens up my day when I see something like that happen. Uh, for, uh, for everyone who follows this channel daily, tomorrow uh, I'm going to make a video that is not going to be based on repairing something. I just want to talk to you about... Uh, just generally what can happen to a hard drive and how you can troubleshoot it uh, the easiest possible ways to give, kind of give you an idea of what's happening with the drive to avoid you from making uh, very critical mistakes that I've noticed a lot of people do nowadays uh, with all of the information being really open source online and YouTube and stuff like that. So stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit like and post comments below if you have any questions. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.